Kinky Blue Fairy is the fashion blogger from Malaysia and she's been involved in the Kuala Lumpur fashion scene for the past 10 years now so she knows all about the trends and developments in the world. So just imagine we're walking down the streets in Kuala Lumpur, Joyce, uh, which fashion trends and styles would really catch her eye? Well, I would say that if you're walking down the streets of KL, you would see a lot of different types of trends. You see girls that are very inspired by the Korean movement, very girly, um, a lot of bows and lace. Um, you can see very colorful people, they're very Japan Japanese inspired, Harajuku inspired, and they've kind of like evolved it into their own Malaysian style. And you can also see a very minimalist take on very black and white silhouette, structured clothing, things like that. Okay, and do you see a change coming in this Malaysian fashion scene? Well, I, I would say that this is the change that is in right now. And if the change that is coming, I would think that a lot of them are going into their different paths a lot more um, like say the ones who are who are Japanese inspired, they've just become a lot crazy in the past two years and the ones who are very minimalist in their dressing and styles, they have become a lot more structured, they started designing their own things as well. So it's, it's really interesting to see all the different changes that KL is going through. So and in, within these changes, which designer should we really keep an eye on? I would say Jo Chia is one of them. He designs very um, he's one of the minimalist designers and he's got very structured clothing, a lot of black and white, things that you can wear to work and every day as well, things that you can wear on a, on a regular basis, which is why a lot of people like the him. Um, Silas Liu is another one to look out for. There's Cassie Gunn and there's also... Wait, I'm going to look at the list because I just... <laughs> there's also people like um, Jonathan Liang, for sure. Jonathan Liang has been showing in Paris for the past few years and he's got these amazing designs every every season. He's got like, um, right now he's got these gauzy skirts and pants. He's always surprising us with different prints and textures and materials. And there's also Cassie Gunn. She has just graduated from London College of Fashion and she likes to mix up different fabrics that she finds from all her travels in Japan and Indonesia and Malaysia. Okay, so. thank you very much, Joyce, for your update. If you guys at home want to see more of our fashion blog, check out kinkybluefairyfashion.com.